hello welcome to today's video well in today's video we're going to be talking about what buy stop limit means and sell stop limit means and how to use them so basically i know most of us might know the meaning of buy limit sell limit buy stop sell stop but i'm not going to explain the most of those ones so okay let me just let me just go to where i can explain this better place a new order okay so this is it please if you're actually new to my youtube channel please don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and also please like this video don't forget to like this video and please leave a comment if you're having any issue on forex any issue pertaining to forex i can help you with it and also please give it a thumbs up don't forget to share the video with other people that are interested in learning forex and also interested in knowing more about the buy stop limit and the sell stop limit so let's dive right in so i can as you can see this is my market execution i'm trying to place an order as you can see as you can see the market execution we have buy limit sell limit buy stop sell stop buy stop limit and sell stop limit so i'll just try and explain everything i guess so buy limit this is the current market price so what buy limit means is the okay okay sorry let me just start again okay this is the current market price yeah yeah this is a current market price the price is coming from yeah once it hits this point it means you want to buy and once it reaches this point once the price can go up back again it means you want the order to be triggered please don't mind don't mind my drawing so once it's coming down once the price is coming down and it's this point the market order should be triggered and once it moves up it should be triggered so let me explain what sell limit means sell, sell limit is opposite of buy limit this is sell limit this is the current market price you want to place an order here this point so it goes up so once the market price once the, once the market price is coming and it's this point the order should be triggered as you can see okay so sell stop this is sell stop is opposite of buy stop as i said this is you mean once the price is come when the price is coming from here and this is the place you want to place your order it means you are placing your your price above above the current price so the market this is your market price and this is the current the current price so once it's coming from here and it passes this place it means you want the order to be triggered so to keep on going up so opposite for buy so once it's going up the other once it reaches point so let's go to the buy stop limit buy stop limit is just same thing it's similar this is your current market price this is your current market price okay and once you know in you know for buy limit once it's coming down you place the order then once it reach up the order should start but for buy limit no once it comes down and hits this point again because you are placing another price here it means once it is once it's come down here is this point and it goes up and it is this point again then the and it goes up and it's this point then it should come down then it can start yeah i'm trying to say it means you have two points two points it has to eat this place they want it reach up here then come down then it can start going up again so that's what this buy limit means so as you can see let me just through the line okay let me say 
um, as you can see this red line here let me just say this is my current this is this is where i want to buy this is my market price it comes here it hits here then and this another price here it hits here then come down and it should start going up so opposite for sell limit sell sorry sell, sell stop limit it's coming here it's here it comes here eat here then start going so as you can see it's easy to understand buy stop limit and sell stop limit so if you still having issues with it please don't forget to comment and i will also help you so you can understand it better so that's it for this video please don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel okay so as you can see you can see it i'm using this device this the buy stop limit you can see they said your current price put your price then put your stop price stop limit price as i said put your stop limit price then you can place your order same thing for sell stop as you can see sell, same thing for sell stop so that's it please don't forget to subscribe to this youtube channel i have more videos coming up next on forex so thanks for watching this video stay tuned see you next week